Folks, let's answer the question. Why would you even paint band t-shirt? Why would you even spend time on a band t-shirt customization? And there are thousands of affordable band t-shirts out there. Well, the key word here is customization. Because are you able to find band t-shirt with the lyrics of your favorite song? Or with the scene from your favorite music video? Or with details and elements which tells what you love about this band the most? No, like all band t-shirts are pretty basic. Logo, then some album cover art, some tour information, and that is pretty much all. So in this video I want to show you how to create absolutely unique t-shirt which will express you and your love to this band. I'm Daria and welcome back to Art Fashion Channel. And first let's prepare a canvas. I'm gonna bleach t-shirt. It's not a necessary step of course, but I think that such bleach effect or tie-dye effect um, will definitely create a vibe and energy of a rock band and will make even simple customization look very very cool and interesting. I'm gonna try to create a spiral bleaching, but you can tie your t-shirt in any way you want. Uh, or you can just pour bleach on your t-shirt. You can also customize white t-shirt and dye it in an interesting way. And I'm mixing bleach with water in one to one ratio. And applying bleach. Well, I didn't damp t-shirt, <laughs> probably it was a mistake, but I thought that with the dry t-shirt I will be able to create such more clean and clear pattern, but we'll see how it will turn out. And the moment of truth. The result is bad, it's not what I expected to see. Uh, probably I should have damped t-shirt or put more bleach, uh, but if you are as bad in bleaching as me, there is always a way to save bad bleaching day. And I'm just putting strokes to create more decent pattern and I feel that situation is under my control now because when I'm using tying techniques I always don't understand what will be the result and how pattern will look like but now I feel that I am able to create pattern which I need for this customization. And voila! And I love how it turned out. It's even better than I expected. And I'm glad that I had to use brush because I'm not sure that I would be able to create such effect using only tying technique. But let's spice it up. I'm gonna use textile spray paint to dye this pattern to make it red. You can also use textile dyes, but you will have to wash them off. Uh, but using spray paint, fabric spray paint, you won't have to wash it off because it works like a fabric paint. You put it on, heat set, and it stays there forever. You can search for textile spray paints on the market or you can even create them yourself by mixing fabric paints with water and putting in a bottle with a pump. Well, now it's time for painting, for custom painting. And if you're a professional artist, you can go wild here. <laughs> you can create band members' portraits or some illustration in your unique style. But in this video, I want to show easy customization, like any beginner can make. Uh, so the first part is part which we can't skip, I guess, because like uh, any band t-shirt should have a name of the band on it. So you can put a name of the band at the center of a t-shirt and then all other elements around the name. Uh, 
or you can create other composition of course. So what are the other elements? Well, it can be anything which represents the band or which you love the most about this band. Uh, some simple quotes or some graphic images like you can search, especially in music videos, you can find a lot of references. Anything simple which you can recreate. So yeah, let's paint. And I have a perfect space at the center of my t-shirt, perfect for the logo which I'm gonna put. And in this video I'm gonna create a money skin band customization. And money skin is my favorite band right now. And I'm sketching out logo on a t-shirt with a chuck. Uh, you can transfer logo from paper onto a t-shirt using transfer paper, which you can buy in any stationery store. And here are the elements from music video which I want to use and as you can see it's pretty easy to create them, draw such images and write. And now I'm coloring logo, it's gonna be white. And logo probably the hardest part of customization because if you put logo which has some unique font, you should make it smooth. And also if you paint on a black t-shirt, you will have to apply at least two layers of paint to make colors with it. Well, I will remove chalk later and it will look much smoother. <laughs> and enough with the smooth fonts. Now we're gonna handwrite and I really recommend you to include handwriting in your customization because it will create such energy and it will instantly give to your customization handmade feeling and look. And it will be so much noticeable that your t-shirt is hand painted, that it's not a print. And of course it's much easier to hand write on clothes rather than create smooth, perfect fonts. And again I'm putting at least two layers of paint to make colors bright and vivid. And I'm using red outliner to outline elements and letters. It's not a necessary step, but in this customization the more interesting effects you create, the more interesting your customization is gonna be. Well, is there any way to paint band members or to paint some scene from your favorite music video? Is there any simple way to do that? Yes, line art. Here is the iconic scene from the music video which I want to include and I outlined it in a drawing app on tablet and I turned it into a line art. And I transfer it directly from the screen. <laughs> Now I'm using white color transfer paper to transfer this drawing from paper onto a t-shirt. And to transfer drawing using transfer paper you need to apply a lot of pressure, especially if you work with a black clothing and you use white color transfer paper. Like The more pressure you apply, the more visible lines are gonna be. I'm using small brush and white color fabric paint for coloring and if you feel that it's hard for you to apply paint to create thin lines with brush, you can dilute your paint a bit with water 
then it will be much easier for you to create lines. But don't forget that if you work with black clothing, you'll have to apply at least two layers of paint to create bright lines. Also, you can add some simple graphic images, stars, lightning, smiley faces, hearts. And lyrics of song, of course, because in my opinion, band t-shirt without lyrics of song is not a band t-shirt. So yeah, write lyrics of your favorite song, one, two sentences, and again, handwrite. Don't try to create a perfect font. and paint splashes for more energy and expression. I'm mixing fabric paint with a small amount of water in a cup, and then I'm using brush to splatter this paint on pouring it directly on a t-shirt. Yeah, I'm creating beautiful, interesting paint splashes. And let's remove Chuck because it started to annoy me. <laughs> And you can also customize the back side of a t-shirt and you can put there, for example, quote, your favorite quote from the band. And I'm gonna put, rock and roll never dies. Well guys, it was a t-shirt customization, but you can use all these ideas for sweatshirt customization, denim jacket customization, leather jacket customization, jeans customization, like you can create the coolest band clothes yourself. Well, now I'll show you the final result. I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope to see you next time. And your like will be so much appreciated. <laughs>